troubleshooting chips with Prof G. PyCharm code completion isn't suggesting code for my libraries. Why am I getting no suggestions when I should be getting suggestions like this? So here's a problem I've noticed sometimes occurs in PyCharm, and I'm not sure why, but I'm coding along and I type in pixels, which is the object, NeoPixel object that I've typed up here, and then I want to use the fill method. Now it should be recognizing it, and it's not. And it's strange because I've imported NeoPixels and it recognizes it. Now it seems that sometimes the interpreter is lost. I don't know why, but it's like my project gets confused. So if you ever find this problem, one thing that I found helpful is if you go to the settings menu, and that's under files in window, it's under PyCharm in Mac, and then you head into your project and then into the interpreter. In this case, it looks like my Python interpreter is not selected. I don't know why, but I can pull down here and I can select my Python interpreter and I can see now I've got all of the different imports that I had before and it's also got in here my NeoPixels, so it should now recognize the package that I had installed earlier. You might not have installed the package and if you didn't you want to click on plus and then you want to look for that particular package. Now another thing that I've noticed is sometimes if you search for packages they don't show up but if you click the refresh button to the right of the search hopefully it'll go out to the internet and it will find them and we can see it took a little bit of time but there we go and if I type in NeoPixel here we can see we got a lot of different options so all of the official CircuitPython ones start with Adafruit dash CircuitPython dash now I've already installed this so that's why it's blue I don't need to install it again but again more information if you run into some problems and things aren't showing up you can check this stuff out so now that I've pulled up my correct Python interpreter let's see what happens if I go back and I do dot fill and we can see now all of a sudden the method which is attached to the NeoPixel class is showing up properly. Hopefully that helps. Keep hacking.